We now move on to bout number six of the show, a Muay Thai demonstration bout. So please welcome into the blue corner from the infamous Woking Thai in Woking, Surrey, Matt Candle. Here in the commentary box with me tonight on this demo bout is Rob Hayward. How you doing, Rob? Yeah, not too bad, mate. It's, Fantastic. Uh, been, been judging this evening, so it's, uh, it's quite interesting being able to commentate on this bout here. It's uh, a demo bout between uh, Matt, uh, I was going to call him Matt Cardle then, the, uh, the guy from The X Factor, but it's, uh, it's, I don't know, he might, he might be able to sing, I don't know. But both guys have got some nice styles about him. I've, I've seen Matt fight before and Serge as well, I believe he was on the last show. Serge was, I don't know about Matt, I've never seen him before. Where have you seen him, Rob? Uh, down Woken Tide. Really? And, uh, yeah. Oh, yeah. wow. I, I, I went down with uh, Batch, he was um, the referee this evening. Oh. Uh, Big overhand right there from Serge. The way, the way of the uh, world of demo bouts is usually let's see how much we can take the piss out of each other, would you say? Yeah, pretty much. I mean, I'm, I'm, I'm more interested this evening actually on the, um, on the on the performance more of the uh, the referee this evening. Yeah, um, me too. Congratulations is in order for him. I believe he's going to be a great grandfather. I, I, I've heard, I've heard. He's, uh, he's showing signs of age with his grey hair, but his his family circumstances changed, and you're, you're, I believe you're correct, Rob. Uh, which is. Good congratulations. Back to briefly the uh, bout <laughs> in progress. No, you know what, for, for a demo bout, I mean, mo most demo belts are usually quite scrappy, quite wild, I mean, because it's the guys right at the beginning of their careers. But, you know, to be both fair, you know, be fair to both these lads here, they've got some nice technical ability about them. They certainly have, Rob. And Serge, Serge holding his power back a little bit, you know, being general, being nice. I think Serge's got a little bit more experience and uh, about seven kilos more weight. On Matt this evening. <laughs> yeah, it's, um, you know, both guys come from very reputable gyms, good trainers as well. I mean, Matt coming from the famous Woken Tie. And uh, the famous Chris Murph in his corner. Yeah, I and mean, then um, Chris is uh, planning these jaunts off to Thailand soon. He was, he was asking me about certain specialist bars out there, but being a family man, is, I don't know that, nothing about what he talks is about. Is that so. Chris Badger or Chris Murphy there? Uh, Chris Murphy asking oh, about Chris him, Murphy asking yeah. about bars. I was too busy training. I'm, oh, I'm, I'm an athlete. Off my face on whatever I can get my hands on. I can't remember a thing. End of round one. We begin the round, number two, with some strong kicks coming from the blue corner. And, um, Serge coming out with his hands nice and tight, looking nice and composed. Matt just stepping out of the power hand there, but Serge backing him up into the corner with some big hands, finishing out with a nice knee. Uh, Serge looking very dominant in this bout, Rob. Yeah, I mean, obviously he is holding the 7 kilo weight advantage. He certainly is. Who's so that guy? I recognise that big, scary looking guy in the red corner there. Who's that, Bryce? That would be Arnold of Borotov, also known as Awesome Arnold. One head of a stable mate to have in your camp. 
Yeah, talking of big scary guys, just uh, to the uh, left of Arnold, you've got Ian Bill, our uh, resident celebrity. We have, Ian Bill is in the audience this evening. And season. big, big hands and knees there as well, coming in from Serge. Just really, really backing Matt up here now. I mean, he's really using that weight advantage. Neither boys are uh, being put off tonight by the heavy celebrity presence of uh, Awesome Arnold and Ian Bill. Some big knees coming in there from Serge. Matt just needs to be careful dropping that head. I mean, we don't want to... Don't want to be taking any headshots, especially in a demo belt. Serge kind of looks like when we spar, Rob, one's getting beaten up and he's smiling. Only kidding. No, I don't beat you up. Oh, <laughs> now I'm sad. <laughs> Serge looking like he's having a lot of fun tonight, not even breaking a sweat. Both boys smiling, having a very good scrap. You know, to be fair, looking at this, it's a demo belt, OK? I know we keep repeating that, but... The, the, the crowd the, don't know, do they? They're all no, shouting. But, you, know, you know, in credit to these guys here, I mean, the, the skill levels of them is a lot better than... Yeah, they're... a lot better than, the, you know, some of the fighters I've seen. C-class, they are. C-class, definitely. Big knee coming up the middle there from Serge. It's a big testament to uh, Woken Thai and KO of the level of their fighters when their inter-club level fighters could quite happily smash some of the professionals we see, Rob. No comment. And that's the end of round two. Round number three. We are off. Fucking good demo about this is. What do you think, Rob? No, no, it's a great fight between the two lads here. Both of them incredible skill levels. Um, For the yeah. level that they're competing at, yes, yeah, certainly. And um, Serge showing some heavy hands there as he's backing Matt up into the corner, and Matt just nicely steps out to the uh, just to the right of him. Fair play to Serge, he took this on a week's notice and uh, you know he doesn't want to have the piss taken out of him. He is clearly the more experienced of the two but Matt doing a fantastic job in holding his own and putting him on the back foot occasionally. I think this is uh, should this be under C-class rules would be a very I think nice at least nice rear hand uppercut from Matt there catching Serge. That was good. And this, um, Okay, and uh, Serge here just getting the back on Matt. He just needs to be cautious there. I mean, if he's turning his back in a C-class belt, or, or, yeah. or B oh, and A-class, I'll say. Yeah, so spinning back kick. Not nice. That's the second time he's caught his opponent in the car. Serge not happy now. He's going to throw a couple of punches to say thanks for that. Another little kick there to the bottom of his opponent's shorts. There's Dixie King shin guards he's wearing this evening. Wants to be careful. Yeah, big hands coming in there from Serge. Matt trying to get his way off the rope. He needs Lovely to try to command. left upper there from Blue. Sorry to interrupt you there, Rob. No, no, of I'm new to this commentary game. Matt just needs to obviously bring his hands up under the chin there instead of Certainly trying to grab under the rope. Certainly he does. Needs to command the centre of the ring instead of back getting himself backed up. He's got a good skill set behind him. I mean, with experience, obviously, that will go. Nice head kick there, though. Well observed. Serge feeling comfortable as long as he doesn't get another foot in the dick. I think he's going to be okay to live to fight another day after this. Both boys just starting to sweat. Oh my god! Oh my god! Big left there from Red Corner! And joined in the commentary box is Vinnie Shulman. That was me impression! Matt Candle and Serge Shorikov. What incredible